This is YSM Sports Media. I want to thank you for all your love and support. Really appreciate it. We wouldn't be able to do this without you. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now and click the notification button for all future content. All right, so Javante Davis is going to face Mario Barrios, I think, at the end of the month. Yeah. He's moving up to 140 to fight Barrios. Yeah, yeah. What's your thoughts on that fight? I got Javante knocking him out. Please. Really? Yes, Yo, he's a big 140, though. Yeah. Even though Javante's coming up, he's, he's going to have that power, that, mm -hmm. that clean power. So I got him knocking him out. Just like how he did, uh, what's his name? Uh, Santa Cruz? Yeah, Santa Cruz, yeah. Yeah, yeah that joke was crazy. Yeah. Got him knocking him out. Do you feel like Tank not having to cut all that weight is going to give him more power? I mean, I, I think it will strain him a little bit. Because he... He eats a lot when he's not fighting. He goes up a lot and when he's fighting. Sometimes, of course, but I think I think he still has that power, though. How do you maintain your weight as a fighter? Uh, I don't eat a lot. I eat good, solid, salmon. Uh, train hard in the afternoon, so I can go home eat good. Now, Barrios ain't a regular 140. He's a big 140. He's like 5'10", 5'11". Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, what if Tank can't hurt him with one shot like he did Gamboa, like he did with um, Santa Cruz? I still, I still got him winning the bout just by, because Tank goes forward a lot too. Mm -hmm. Try to knock, knock his opponent's head off. I still got him winning that just by going forward, trying to punch him. Do you feel like he should get a whole lot of credit going up and being the undefeated? Champion yeah, at 140 yeah, pounds? Sure. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Now, you want him to stay at 140 or go back down to 130, 135? Stay, stay at 140. No. Matter of fact, I would like him to go back down because I would like to see him fight Lomachenko or somebody like that, Tiafimo. That would be good. That's good for him. What about Ryan Garcia? You want to see that one? Yeah, for sure. For sure. I think Ryan Garcia is scared of him, though. Okay. Yeah. What's your thoughts as, as Ryan Garcia as a fighter? He's cocky. He's cocky. He's, he's fast. But, uh, I seen him get knocked out by Campbell. Yeah, I think Javante is killing him. I think Javante is killing him. Um. People were making a big deal about Devin Haney getting, I guess, not wobble, but, you know, the, the yeah, noodle leg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His recent fight, right? Yeah. Can you be labeled chinny without getting knocked out or knocked down? No, no not, I mean, no, not really. No. You feel like that was just unnecessary criticism? Yeah, yeah. Tank versus Devin Haney. Is that something you gotta see yeah. in the next couple of years? Yeah, for sure. They gotta make that happen fast. Who wins that fight? Yeah, I think you might be a Tank fan, tank. bro. <laughs> I got Tank. You think Tank beats everybody? Tank on that one, yeah. yeah. I think you, I think you got a uh, fitting you for punches. Yeah, yeah. But I ain't, I ain't really think Devin Haney looked as good as last fight. Mm -hmm. But I guess I'm not a bummer, but. Person that's not really good. I mean, Lenars was, yeah, I mean, he yeah, was yeah, good. He but was good. Yeah, you talking about a guy that's yeah. past his prime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Against Devontae, I think Devontae is killing Do you think Tank is the best fighter out of all these young crap of fighters? Tiafimo, Ryan, Devin? Uh, I got, I think Tiafimo. I like Tiafimo a lot too. Mm -hmm. but I got, honestly, I got Tiafimo being Tank. Okay. All right. Thanks, Chris. I appreciate it.